This is the unboxing of the My Passport WD My Passport one terabyte external hard drive. Got the hard drive, straight plastic. Feels solid though, it's plastic, but it feels solid. Um, what else did it come with? USB cord. What else we got in the box? Bunch of instructions that we don't need. Pretty much it right here. This is a hard drive. Have a review right after this unboxing. It's pretty small too. It could fit right in your pocket. Yeah, yeah. So what up? <clears throat> this is the Western Digital One Terabyte My Passport hard drive. Yeah. So this is a quick review. Um, this thing's real slick right here. You know, if you film a lot of videos, you do a lot of music like I do. You're gonna need that extra uh, memory. So you know what I mean. This is this is what I got. That's what I went for. I went for that Western Digital, my passport, one terabyte. This thing's a pretty good hard drive right here. Um, it's all plastic. You know, I just threw the Apple stick on there because it was just plain black, you know. Um, it's all plastic and shit, you know what I mean? The only thing is, you know, it's pretty good, but the only thing, you know, they got this short-ass cord, which I'm going to show you in a second. <clears throat> got to have it real close to your computer. Cause the cord is real short, but uh, besides that, this thing's pretty pretty solid right here. Um, you know, it has a lot of memory, so it hold whatever uh, file you're gonna put on it. You know, works for Mac and Windows. You know, what I mean, hundred dollars, it's a good buy right here. So if you're looking for a hard drive, I suggest this one right here, my Passport Western Digital. Good hard drive. If you need that extra memory pretty quick too I think it's our 3.0 USB yeah so um I'm about to show you how to uh, format it real quick and I'm gonna show, connect it to the uh, to the MacBook and show you how short this damn cord is but uh, besides that it's pretty good hard drive so uh, if you're looking for external hard drive it'll fit right in your pocket just don't look no further just cop that Western Digital uh, my passport. It's legit right here. So I right, right there, um I got it plugged into my MacBook. As you can see, the cord is going from there to there so the cord's real short so you're gonna have to have your your laptop close to your um external hard drive it's real short the cord um besides that though oh, man, good hard, the hard drive. drive for the mac is going to your uh applications and then you're gonna go into utilities which is right over here utilities then you're gonna go to this utilities It's gonna bring up all your options. Gonna bring up your uh, passport or whatever external drive you got plugged in. Look at that right here. You go to erase. You go to format. I got it as Mac OS external journalist. Just to work for the Mac, but uh, I did have it for uh, for Windows and Mac. But when you do that, which is MS DOS FAT, when you do that. 
can only tra transfer uh, four gigabyte size files into your uh, hard drive at a time. So you know, I can't can't deal with that. I need to transfer them the big files in there. So it's the only thing with the the MSDOS FAT that it lets you only transfer four gigabytes at a time. But yeah, so you just put on Mac OS if you're a Mac user, but if you want to use it for Windows and Mac, M MSDOS FAT. Go ahead, raise. I have formatted for you. You can all set. That's basically it. Great hard, great hard drive. If you don't have advice, anybody that don't have it, you need that extra memory to buy it. It's a must.